Did you follow the big news about Tesla Autopilot that came out last night? In the first quarter of 2024, Tesla reported a significant safety achievement with its Autopilot technology with one accident per 7.63 million miles driven, which is more than 11 times better than the US average. Welcome back everyone, this is Armin Haria from TorqueNews.com. If you're here first time, please give us thumbs up and support our channel with some super things I would greatly appreciate as I'm telling this very interesting story. So Tesla has finally decided to release its autopilot safety data report after taking a break of more than a year. Why a year? I don't know. For years, Tesla used to release a vehicle safety report that tracked miles between accident in its vehicles based on the level of autopilot used or not used and compared it to the industry average. The automaker used the report to claim that its autopilot technology resulted in a much safer driving experience and that its vehicles would crash much less often than the average car in the United States even without autopilot. The data was always limited and criticized for not taking into account that accidents are more common on city roads and in the undivided roads than on the highways where autopilot is most commonly used. But it was the only data that Tesla was willing to release about its autopilot and therefore it was still useful to track some progress. However, Tesla stopped reporting the data after Q4 2022 without explaining why. If you have any reasons why you think Tesla would do that, please let us know in the comment section below. Anyway, interestingly, quarter one 2023, which Tesla is only releasing now, showed a significant decrease in miles driven between accidents compared to the same period for the year prior, which might explain why Tesla stopped releasing the data at that time. The automaker is only now releasing the data as quarter one 2024 shows a significant improvement for autopilot. However, note that this data doesn't include full self-driving, although that gets murky as of late since Tesla now uses the same software stocks with limited functionalities for autopilot. It's nice to see a significant improvement in safety in quarter one 2024, despite the limited usefulness of the data. However, I'm really disappointed in Tesla for only releasing the data, not that it starts looking better and stopping the release the data in quarter one 2023 as it looked bad. So let me know your thoughts, friends. What do you think about this autopilot now shining in uh, quality? and safety, you know, uh, which is approximately 11 times better than the U.S. Na national average from what I understand. This is Armin Haria from TorqueNews.com and if you uh, watched this thus far, please consider supporting this channel with super thanks uh, or subscribing to our channel and give us thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. God bless you and see you soon in our next report.